restarting this book the compound effect if you've never read it definitely check it out it's totally life-changing um so yeah i don't like to jump into like work or anything especially anything stressful first thing i like to try to get my mind right in the morning um and then i usually don't eat for like at least an hour or two that's just because i'm simply not hungry the water and the coffee just kind of holds me over i guess for a little while um so then after my morning routine i will do a little bit of work and then eat when i'm hungry get ready and go to the gym but I will catch you guys up when I have breakfast. So I'm actually just gonna start the day with this perfect bar. Um, normally I'll have like a normal meal, but I have some errands that I need to run, so I kinda wanna just um, eat quickly. But these bars do have 320 calories, which is a lot for a protein bar. And they are very high in fat, um, and they do have quite a bit of sugar, but the sugar is from natural sources. And um, although it is high in fat, since it's so high calorie, this is basically just like a small meal. Um, so yeah, these are really great for just kind of on the go or whatever. These are like my favorite protein bars. So I'm just going to have this and then I'll catch you guys up when I have my bigger first meal. All right. Now that I am more human, like I'm going to go run some errands, drop off some Poshmark orders and do some shopping and yes, then I will catch you up. I'll probably have like breakfast food, but it would be like lunchtime. <laughs> Right, I just got home from running some errands and I'm freaking starving so now I'm gonna have like brunch I guess so I am gonna make like a breakfast sandwich and I'm gonna use there's so many different kinds of breads but I'm gonna use this sourdough bread so I'm normally gluten-free but sourdough bread is processed completely different than regular bread so although it's not gluten-free it is sprouted and it is a fermented food so I feel like it's more easily digestible even if you are gluten-free but if you have like celiac or something more serious, you still wouldn't be able to have sourdough. But um, yeah, I eat this and feel totally fine from it. So I'm gonna have this with, with some eggs. I always buy different brands, but I always try to get either um, pasture raised or free range. And these are, this is the Vital Farms brand. So these are really good. And then, And then I'm going to use avocado and some organic turkey slices. Decided I'm going to cut up some tomatoes as well. I love tomatoes just by themselves with pink salt. So good. <laughs>
So I just finished eating, but a lot of times after meals, I crave something sweet, which is bad, but I have learned to swap like chocolate for healthier alternatives. So this is my favorite fruit of all time and you can only get it like a month out of the year. But if you guys have never had cotton candy grapes, life changing. I don't understand it. I don't get how they do it, but they literally taste like cotton candy. Like it's a miracle. So I'm gonna have some of these and then I'll catch you guys at lunch or dinner or whatever I have next. Thank you. at my local juice bar because I had a free coffee and I almost never ever ever get iced coffee or iced lattes but it is 110 or about that and I just wasn't feeling a hot one today so and then I also got these almond butter chocolate chip cookies which are amazing they're protein cookies and check out those ingredients this place is bomb for dinner I'm doing like a healthy uh, taco salad so we have the lettuce the spinach um, I'm not doing cheese but um, what else? Avocado. What else is in there? Tomatoes. Yeah, the dressing. Oh, and the CHA chips. For the last thing that I'm going to be eating today, I'm just going to have some of this garlic hummus with red bell pepper. And, oh, actually, you know what? And I'm also going to have some of my favorite crackers, which are these um, Simple Mills sea salt crackers. Actually, I like all the flavors, but these are awesome. So yeah, I'm just gonna have some of this with the hummus and bell peppers. So I realized I totally forgot to film an outro uh, clip for yesterday's full day of eating. So it is actually the next day, but I hope you guys enjoyed. That was everything that I ate yesterday. I hope it was helpful or informative or just entertaining in one way or another. Um, I don't know why full day of eatings are just so entertaining. I like to watch them as well. So hopefully you guys liked it, enjoyed it, and lots more videos to come. I'm going to California with my friend next weekend. We're gonna do all the fun, um, healthy food and dessert places and lots of going to the beach. We're going to Santa Monica, so if you have any suggestions of good healthy food places or dessert places, please let me know. And with that, I appreciate you guys watching and I'll see you in the next video.